Yeah, so we're down here on the Hull Marina this morning on a, an absolutely wonderful um, day. The sun's shining, there's a lot going on, a lot of excitement. And we're here with Mal Nicholson who owns the, um, the pickle that you see behind us. Uh, would you like to tell us what's going on down here today, Mal? Yeah, good morning everybody. Uh, basically, um, this um, day has been created for young carers and uh, effectively we've got various uh, young carers coming aboard today. Um, there have been a, a lot of local companies supported us, um, you know, that have donated either food or goods or whatever uh, to make the day a success. And I thank them very much. Um, and effectively uh, we've got a group um, called Hearts of Oak that are uh, here and have worked with us before um, to display and demonstrate the um, sort of heritage of the sea and all the rest of the sort of paraphernalia that went with like an 18th century ship such as the Pickle um, so that they can bring an experience to Hull um, that is quite unique and hopefully people will look and learn and enjoy enjoy the sunshine and the great camaraderie that's sort of uh, developing uh, as we speak. Hi, my name's Deanne Thomas. I'm the Chief Exec of Sailors Children's Society. Welcome to HMS Pickle. We're down in Hull Marina for the day. It's beautiful blue skies and sunshine. And we're welcoming children with caring responsibilities for a free treat with us today. Hi, my name's Carl Harrison and I basically work as a bosun on board HMS Pickle. My, my job is everything from the deck to the top of the mast. I do all the rigging, all the sails, any splicing, any repairs, organise the guys, get them working and uh, basically convey any orders that the skipper, skipper gives while he's in his cabin. I'll be showing people around the boat, I'll also be climbing the rigging later, firing cannon and uh, generally doing sailor things. Hello, I'm representing Captain John Richards Lapinotier, the man that brought the famous news from Trafalgar that Britain had won the battle and had the sad loss of Lord Nelson. So today's come about, uh, the captain and owner Mal Nicholson really wanted to give something back to the children who have those extra responsibilities in our local area. We teamed up as Sailors Children's Society to bring some families along and also other local families came along really to have a nice day and just really to give those kids a treat. Um, something we're looking to do on an annual basis. Yeah, it's going very well, the um, children and the youngsters are enjoying it, um, the adults are enjoying it just as much if not more, um, the people that are doing, um, you know, all of the sort of policing and help, they're all doing uh, very, very well and generally the crew and myself are, you know, what a day, what a lovely day. Well, I think this is a fantastic idea by Mal, and I mean, 
often the, these carers, these young people, they get forgotten. There's not a lot for them, and this is fantastic, you know. And he's put so much work into it, so much effort, um, and he's been rewarded with the most beautiful day. And as we all know, Hull and the Marina on a sunny day, there is nowhere better. You could be abroad. It looks fantastic. Um, but you know, to put all this on and to, to have the, the, the reenactment, to have all, everything done, real cannons, the kids being able to play with and, and look at the, the, the weapons, the cannons and everything, fantastic. And you know, all great for these people who give so much and do so much. Mal asked me to come down on the day, say hello to the, to, to the youngsters, which is what I've done, and I've thoroughly enjoyed it. It's been, it's been fantastic. Right. Thank you very much for coming along. I hope you enjoy the rest of Thank your day. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well, we're here supporting HMS Pickle today, um, and today, the Saturday, we're, we're welcoming on board uh, young carers. And then tomorrow, we've got all the public coming on board, hopefully, with this wonderful weather down here at the basin. Um, and what Hearts of Oak do, we, um, we represent the Royal Navy, the British Royal Navy, uh, of roughly about 1800, a few years before, a few years afterwards. There. And, and that's about Nelson, really. And of course, the, the pickle, HMS Pickle, was famous for bringing back the news of Trafalgar, this, this wonderful, great uh, uh, triumph over, uh, over the French and Spanish fleet, and of course the sad news that Nelson lost his life during the battle. Um, I believe you're also known as the ship surgeon um, and behind us are, I'm assuming this is where you do your work, there won't be any cutting up of anybody's today hopefully. Well you never know Carol, if anybody's not feeling too well this is the place to come. Yeah this represents the uh, the ship surgery, the sick bay, uh, which would have been on any large ship of the line there, 74 guns and above. And um, I again represent the ship surgeon of the time. I would have had a complete surgical staff underneath me as well. Maybe another two uh, other surgeons, young young surgeons coming on, and sick bay attendants. And we'd be looking after, in, in the main, we'd be looking after sickness. Uh, amongst the crew and accidents, but of course when uh, when battle was joined the the wounds were horrendous Not so much from the cannonballs not so much from musket balls But from what they called splinters which could be anything from well a couple of centimeters long up to a couple of feet long So you're looking at some major injuries and death uh, on board a ship. It would have been carnage And it was the ship surgeon that had to try and keep the the crew healthy Repair them in the case of injury there, get them back working again, because without the crew, the ship doesn't sail. Right, and, and that will be your job for today, then you will be looking after everybody's medical needs, should, that, should any arise, hopefully the ones. Well, fingers crossed. <laughs> And what we do is we'll fire the cannons, we'll be firing the muskets and the pistols, uh, as well as telling anybody that wants to talk to us about life at that time, below decks, as well as the officer class above decks. So they can experience what it was like um, being a gunner 
um, on board HMS Victory uh, with our, our, uh, our cannon deck here that we have. And firing cannons. Now, for the children, they fire small caps out of the cannons there. Uh, but a little bit later on, we will be firing our full-size cannon. And I think everybody in Hull will probably hear that. Ha, ha, ha.